Menstrual cramps or painful menstrual periods are extreme crampy pains that some women face during their menstrual cycles and this causes them to take leaves during the menstrual cycles month on month causing loss of school activity and also loss of pain. Hi, I'm Dr. Saman Singh, Senior Obstetrician and Gynecologist at Birthright Rainbow Hospital, Vanagata Road, Bangalore. And today I would like to talk about certain common causes for painful periods. Among the different causes, we have endometriosis, adenomyosis, fibroids, pelvic inflammatory diseases, and cervical stenosis as a common cause for painful periods. So what are these conditions? In endometriosis, we find that there is a reversal of the flow. The menstrual blood, instead of coming out through the vagina, some of it goes into the reverse direction, into the tubes and the ovaries and forms what are called as endometriotic cysts or the chocolate cysts. Now these cysts will cause the woman to have severe pain, crampy pains. Sometimes they'll be rolling with pain during the periods. And this is something that needs attention because it can, if unattended, can cause in the future, you know, severe infertility problems, it can cause adhesion formation, and women can also have painful defecation and painful intercourse. What is adenomyosis? In adenomyosis, there is seepage of the menstrual blood in between the layers of the muscle of the uterine wall, and this causes severe congestion during the periods, causing the lady to have crampy pains and also heavy periods or prolonged periods. So again, this is a condition that needs attention because over a period of time, she can have severe blood loss and of course, the pain is incapacitated. The third condition which commonly causes menstrual pain are fibroids. Now here, the lady has tumors which are non-cancerous. They are growths inside the wall of the uterus and they comprise of muscle tissue and fiber tissue. And depending upon the position and the number of the fibroids, the lady can have severe pain before and during her periods. Now fibroids are usually seen in some women who have delayed pregnancies or if there's a family tendency and again it can lead to fertility issues in the future so it needs to be treated. Other conditions like chronic pelvic infection if left untreated over a long period of time can cause congestion again in the pelvic organs and this can also cause painful periods. Cervical stenosis is a condition wherein the outlet for the menstrual blood flow is restricted and therefore there is a lot of collection of the menstrual blood inside the uterine cavity which causes severe pain during periods. Now all these conditions need proper treatment, diagnosis and management so that the long term sequelae of these problems are mitigated. One common myth that women have is that whether they can take painkillers during their menstrual cramps, it is perfectly fine to take the painkillers and be comfortable but that is not all, okay? The conditions must be diagnosed and evaluated properly and then the management must be appropriate. Do feel free to reach out to us if you have any questions. We are here to help you. Thank you.